A fiery fatal crash on I-57 halted traffic for hours last night. One of the victims was a prominent developer on the south side known for making contributions in his community. CBS 2 Sandra Torres reports. A chaotic scene along I-57 near Madison as bystanders jump in to help when they came across this scene. Illinois State Police say it happened around 845 Friday night. A Lamborghini with two passengers headed southbound on I-57 lost control while traveling at a high rate of speed and crashed onto trees on the west side of the highway. He came from the left side all the way over. The medical examiner identified the victims as 26-year-old Samaya Jadat and 45-year-old Jacob Duche, a prominent developer in the city's south side known as Jacob the Builder. When I um, heard the news this morning, yes, it was devastating. Tracy Perkins lives in a home built by Jacob in the Bronzeville neighborhood. He wanted to bring and build our community back up mm -hmm. and give it a whole nother perspective. And um, that's what he offered when he when he built my home. He built dozens of homes like these in Bronzeville. Throughout the community, you can see signs that say his name. Alderman Pat Dowell says they're a sign of his vision. He's one of the small minority of African-American developers who took a chance on a black community and invested his money in the area and it paid off for him. And while much of his work is left unfinished, his legacy lives on. People should remember him as someone who loved Bronzeville. We're praying for his family, his children, his wife. Uh, it's a devastating loss for somebody that young with young children to be taken that quickly. Sandra Torres, CBS 2 News. It's still unclear who was driving the car at driving the car at the time of the crash, which remains under investigation.